Photographs have been shared online showing strange balls of lights in the sky above India. Residents have detailed that late in the night, mysterious objects can be seen hovering in the sky, pulsating from orange to red, and also making no noise, with others saying that the shape of these mysterious objects doesn't match anything like a plane or a helicopter. One of the first times this happened was back in June of 2021, with many locals being able to photograph the glowing objects while they remain stationary in the sky. But now residents have said that the objects have reappeared, causing confusion about what these things are. Religious people living in the region saw these strange lights as some sort of sign, while others were sure that the lights belonged to one craft, noting that they seemed to blink one by one, and which caused online researchers to say that these lights came on eerily similar to those that were seen above Phoenix. Some of these images have made their way online, and it's led to some people saying that these belong to a V-shaped craft, while others who don't believe in these crafts suggested that it could be a natural phenomenon. According to Narathrum Sharu, an advisor at the Council of Science and Technology, they said the following about the strange objects. In the Saurashtra region, people sighted 30 to 40 mysterious lights blinking in a straight line. This caused curiosity and fear in people of the region due to blind beliefs. However, according to space science, such light sightings could be for three reasons. It could be either because a small portion of a meteorite had entered the surface of the Earth, or it could be a shooting star. But this particular sighting looks like multiple lights in a row. This could be because of some satellites passing through low Earth orbit, there are more than 3,000 satellites functional in the lower orbit of the Earth. This is definitely a sighting of some satellite. There is nothing to worry about. End quote. Not everyone was entirely won over by this explanation though, with locals who live close to the region and online users saying that the lights stayed in the sky for a long period of time and didn't appear to drop in altitude. Those who investigate strange objects have said that meteorites are often used to explain away these sightings, saying that for the Phoenix lights they try to say it was military flares, even though people witnessed the lights long before the flares were dropped, and that the lights seemingly stayed in the sky for several hours. Due to the two events looking similar, some have suggested that the objects could have been the same, with explanations ranging from a top secret military aircraft to an experimental aircraft that was being flown close to the area. However, as some have pointed out, if these do belong to the military then why do they choose to fly over populated areas? For years now, large crafts that appear to be in the shape of a triangle have often been reported over densely populated areas, and this has led some to ask why the military would do this. It's no secret that the military and other installations have planes and high-tech equipment that many of us aren't aware of, so why risk showing these above areas that are heavily populated? It's one of the reasons why amateur researchers have suggested that these crafts may not actually belong to us, and that they could be coming from somewhere else. It's also interesting to note that military records have shown that these large crafts have even been detected above military installations, and on many occasions jets have had to be scrambled in order to find out what these things are, and it's the main reason why government officials have labelled these crafts as a national security threat. On top of being able to go in and out of radar, these crafts are seemingly untouchable. As of right now, these blinking crafts that appear to hover over densely populated areas are often reported throughout the year, and although explanations like military flares and meteorites are given to us, People are not convinced that this is what's actually being seen, leading some to put forward their own theories to explain what they're seeing. Interestingly, it seems that documents have revealed that India is actually somewhat of a hotspot for mysterious flying aircrafts. Going back a few years ago, 930,000 declassified documents were posted online by the Central Intelligence Agency, and one of them revealed that a mysterious craft was detected above India, the document goes on to detail how intelligence officials in the area couldn't explain what was being seen, 
saying that a large disc, silver in colour and able to travel at extreme speeds, appeared to be interested in an area in India. The area couldn't be identified due to being blacked out. The case file then goes on to note that after trying to catch up with the strange craft, which was unsuccessful on a number of occasions, the officials were left scratching their heads as to what they just encountered. This is just one of many events that remain a mystery. It's due to these kinds of sightings and reports that some have said these objects are unknown to us, or at least they were unknown to us at one point in time. Even today pilots is still coming forward in detailing their strange encounters with machines that appear to not only have the ability to outmaneuver them, but notes that if things ever did go south, they wouldn't have any chance of being able to put up a find. Sadly, although there's mountains of evidence pointing towards the fact that these crafts are genuine, pilots and other professionals are still being judged when they come forward with their encounters. So what do you make of these photographs? And what do you think these crafts are? Be sure to leave your questions and answers in the comment section below and help us to grow this community while working to solve these unexplained mysteries. Thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more videos.